Hi and welcome everyone to another episode of Gaming with Jason. Okay, so I have uh, finally gotten my OBS working. Now it's going to be a little bit different. So I'm going to do two playthroughs at once. So I'm playing two servers at once. I'm going to show you both of them. That way you guys can watch them and it cuts down on the amount of videos that I'm putting up. Uh, one for editing process and two, it just I don't want to just spam everybody with all these videos all at once. Um, I, I wouldn't like it if it was being done to me. So I, I want to make sure that I don't overdo it. But I, I do like putting up videos and... You know, I'm figuring out how to do the streaming part. So we're going to start where I always start. I always start with Spain. So let's go ahead and get in with Spain. Uh, let me pull up. Where did it go? Spain. Okay, interact. All right, I'm still learning how to, how to do this with OBS. It takes a minute. But uh, I have somewhat figured it out. All right, so it looks like I have taken this here. So let me split and sand all over the island. And then what I want to do here is just make sure I clean up my mess. This is what, whenever I tell someone clean up their mess, this is what I'm talking about is um, I want you to go and get all these red tiles and get rid of them because um, when you do, then that means it takes away from the war. Uh, and more awareness and once you once you clear it out so for example if we look here on me let's look here I am at war with France Italy Poland so uh, as you see I took every tile of Portugal and I'm not at at war with them I'm not at war with Mali and I'm not at war with Morocco because I took every single tile so those are less war open conflicts that I have that are going to create some sort of uh, I don't know how else to put it, it, it to create some uh, some sort of strategy so that you you don't have your cities so for example has it been midnight it's coming up close on midnight uh, I'm still at 25% here so man and I'm gonna jump up I'm curious so I am sitting here at number five and I'm about 80 points out and I've collected 5, 11, uh, 15, 21. Ah, I've collect, I'll, I'll collect close to like 40, 50 points uh, before the end of all this, which is kind of nice. So I don't really have to worry about too much and it's a quick walkthrough. I mean... If you guys saw what I started with this morning, you will see that, um, if you guys see what I started with this morning, you'll see how, how this really just, wow. Anyways, um, let's see, check this, uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. okay, so I've got some open slots, and, oh, I've got, uh, do, I don't want another destroyer yet, but, do, and these are all ones. Um, oh, and let's see. I need to... Do I have any twos? Okay. I need to start getting twos. Army base two. And the reason why I want the army base two is because i got these tanks and I haven't been able to use them. And it's time to... Uh, I've got a lot of resources coming in. Um, I've got peace with the Middle East. And just to kind of give you an update of what's going on with me and... Uh, me and Ukraine, we are deciding to... We're, we're talking it out still. Do we want to go? I wonder if he responded. His message. Uh, um, let's see who will make an extra spot. Uh, then go from there. Okay, so let me send something to the United States. Do you have two spots or only one? And I will send something to Saudi. Do you have only one spot or can you make two? And let's see. Let's see who responds first. Uh, a lot of this is is. It tells me their activity of how quickly and how often they respond. 
so the USA responded to me in the morning but I haven't seen him at all so if I don't hear from him by bedtime I know he's only coming on once a day uh, I've heard from Saudi he comes on and he, he, he spent a, a few minutes talking with me so he's a little bit more active maybe not as active as the rest but um, my big thing is that people tend to get big and then want to walk away from it and let it just uh, play out and get their points instead of oh wow almost there instead of uh, you know going and getting them all done so we're having a, a chat in my discord server and uh, beyond dreams asked a question he's he asked would it be better to get more gold uh, and just kind of fester it out or let it um, or, or or close out the server because he can win and just take the win and it's like no dude you take the win because I only play on three servers and right now you see me playing on two but I only play on three servers and yeah you know, so I don't I don't want to um, okay, so how long until these are done? I, I don't want to have too many open servers because then that's too many because what happens, and this happens to me multiple times, I'll have like three or four servers open. <coughs> and then somebody will come in and swipe me in one server and then I'm getting swiped in another server. And next thing you know, uh, uh, I, I don't even it just it, I, I'm, I'm trying to manage two servers and then a third and a fourth and it's like well I can't pay attention to that so if you want to be able to pay attention you want to increase your winning percentage and your winning odds you got to pay attention to your server uh, that's important and we're we're done here for now and let's go over to the Philippines okay Hi and welcome everyone to the evening playthrough. Now that I am using OBS, so my green screen got in, but my capture card hasn't arrived, and my dummy battery hasn't arrived, nor has my new stand. So I'm still waiting on those four pieces. Uh, I really need the capture card so that the I can get a good screen with my. Uh, so that I can get a, a good capture because I'm using a camera that really it's it's not really built to do anything other than maybe do Skype uh, you know every once in a while but anyways let's get into the game uh, let's see we're in the Philippines let's go into here and let's see I just started building a couple of units uh, I finally got my uh, I got my other city up and running, and I am building uh, helicopters, infantry, anything I can build that I have uh, that I have troops for. And I also started my next level of research to get up to where's my heavies. Okay, so um, I'm working on that because I want to get up here uh, so that I can have a hit of let's see. Uh, I get a hit of 14 and a range of 3500 plus a, a hit of 8 on submarines and so that's what my goal is and as soon as I get done upgrading my uh, my tanks to where I can at least airlift them uh, I want to get them actually no I don't need to I just need to get them there so that I can uh, so that I can do an airlift and then that way I can get them across and I don't have to worry about it and then what I'm going to be working on is my helicopters. And my helicopters are important because, um, I don't know, it's just, I want to be able to have these up so that they can start attacking so that I can use them as my coastal defense since I'm not going to be able to take them overseas. But I am also working on my planes. I, let's see here, my superiority. Oh, I am working on that as well. Um, I want to get that up so that I can protect my uh, protect my planes because I don't know what this guy has I just know that he has stuff 
And so I've got naval patrol planes over here. Let me show you. I've got naval patrol. Where did I go? Oh, sorry. I forgot where. Okay, sorry. Oh, I'm still learning OBS on how to use it in kind of a live streaming way. It's still fairly new to me. Anyways, I see that I have, so you see this is the radar that I have. So now I can see what he has around here. And just, and I'm trying to stay at a distance so he can't really see me. He might on the edge of his screen see a, a green dot come up every once in a while. But he's not going to, unless he's really like watching it when it happens, he's not going to really see it. So I'm not too worried about that. Plus I've got... Uh, so I'm making sure that I'm putting my air superiorities to protect the air base here and so that's what those guys are there for and then I have my strike fighters are there to protect my coastline while I build up another wing of them uh, of my of my naval strike fighters so when I come in contact with his Navy I want to be able to sink everything that he has with just a one task force of uh, one task force of, of destroyers that are only level four i want to be able to show you that you that navy is an asset it is, is something to be used it is not something to be relied upon like so many people do is they forget that there's a little bit more to a naval strategy and so as philippines i'm forced to do a naval strategy and that is kind of where we're at right now. I'm waiting for upgrades to happen. I'm not in a super huge rush. I will probably in the morning do my blitz. And then we will we will go from there. But it looks like... I mean, I pulled the one plane over that I got. And let's see, what do I have over here? I have the superiority. I need to get that naval strike fighter over to here and so that being said let us go and see what Spain looks like all right here is dadgummit I do that every time uh, cancel okay so I need to go to here and interact okay perfect and there we go all right, so let's see what I've done over here. Um, I am still working on the military bases. Oh wait, I don't want to upgrade that. Okay, so let's let's start working on some of these. Okay, so I got a two there. I, I want I want to tank really really bad. So I can do thirteen twenty five there, or how long until my twos are done? Let's look at it this way. Okay. Well, which is more important to me? And how long until this is done? Oh, I can wait that long. How long is it going to cost me? 150 gold? There. Now let me get my rocks off. Alright. Let's go to armor. And we're going to do our first tank destroyer. Alright. So I got my tank destroyer. I got another one of my these being built let's see here I have some attack helicopters here and let's see here um, let's do an attack helicopter here too and let's do let's see what do I have the choice of do I have no so I can do an attack helicopter here again and here let me do let me do a gunship <laughs> I'm just building I'm building some air units right now because right now I need that um alright so let's look at see what I have here so as you can see um, oh I gotta check in and see what Ukraine has said Let's see what Ukraine has said. Sounds like a plan. If not, we can probably. Okay. So, um, 
That way he knows. Uh, I, that way I'm not leading him on. I don't want to lead him on, have somebody get booted, and then kind of screw over a coalition. That's not right. So I don't want to do that. Okay, so now I can start doing some research. Let's see. I have got... <coughs> <coughs> Okay, I'm not going to I'm not going to do that anymore. Let's see here. I have I don't need I'm not going to be focused on that right now. Let's see here. I need to focus on I have armor. Let me I know that this is going to be a sacrifice, but let me let me get this to be where I can get these airlifted and then work on my helicopters I mean I'm doing the same thing with um, with Philippines I think it'd be good to follow that measure uh, and get that up but okay so we got that there um, we but here here's the thing I could actually start working the gunships are the most vulnerable and those are the ones I kind of wanna I want to get some shielding on first so I'll probably upgrade this and then I'll upgrade that and then this and then that and then this until because I know I'm not worried about getting the if you go over here I mean there is one little bonus that you get for going up here and that is you go to an 8.1 defense versus what you get here which is a 7.5 so you get another 0.6 defense uh, and let's see uh, it's six attack I did not see the attack and you get another half a point in attack and you know the thing is is it, you also get more hit points you get more I think your attack range goes up maybe from 15 to 20 but this is uh, so you get, and, and these are all the different things. Okay, whatever. Oh, wow. So with this, I can actually attack ships. I did not know that. Um, it doesn't mean that I can actually do any damage to them, but I can attack them. <laughs> that, that seems like a developer mistake right there. All right. But that's why, that's why I'm not really too worried about it. Because, I mean, I get, I get a little bit of a boost, but not enough, not enough to make a difference. Um, until like later in the game when I just want to have it because I can. Okay, so let me get my my stuff. Um, I'm trying to keep my my helicopters organized so that uh, they don't interfere with my uh, so that they don't interfere with my uh, other planes because I hate it that it goes with the shortest range. So let's see here. I'm gonna do that. Let's see, I got another helicopter there. Okay. I got another one of those planes there. And let's just make sure I got everything. Um, yeah, I got my whole everything done there. Okay. That sounds good. Um, it looks like I have looks like everything's going good for me. Um Oops, sorry about that, guys. Um, it doesn't look like you've been able to see. So this is what I have here. Okay, um, I didn't realize. Uh, I think I screwed up. So let me check this here. Yeah, I screwed up. All right. Well, you know, it's a learning mistake. I'd rather rather learn now than later. All right. And so this is this is what my night is. And as you see, I pretty much completely engulfed Italy like that. That was. I was pretty easy. I have not heard hide nor hair or seen anything from this kid. I think he quit. And I think I'm going to boot him because I haven't heard from him. Um, yeah, let's kick because he went inactive. I think he lost his capital city last night. Or, yeah, he lost his capital city last night. And I think he quit because he was hoping that I would, you know, that I would save him. But he didn't realize that all he has to do is rebuild his headquarters and he'd be just fine. You know, if you know that somebody's coming at your at your headquarters, move your headquarters in advance so that you can protect your your cities and the rest of your holdings. So it's important. Um, but with that, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, and close that out. We are done for the night, and I want to say thank you for joining me. Uh, if you would like to subscribe. 
Uh, I'd love to hear your feedback. Uh, what do you think of my strategy? If you've made it this far, what do you think of my strategy? Uh, thank you for joining me, and I will see you tomorrow morning. Good morning, guys. Uh, okay, so apparently I started my stream, and I forgot to plug in my microphone. Uh, <laughs> so let's start back here. I am being attacked by Cuba. Um, I gotta stop doing that. I'm so you when when I see it, it's it's pretty much my computer screen, and so it just I, I keep forgetting that I gotta click another button to interact with it, and so I keep moving the screen around. I apologize if you guys see that, but welcome to I keep hitting the wrong button again. Welcome back to another uh, episode of Gaming with Jason. I am being attacked. Um, right now I'm in the process of eliminating Cuba and I think what he he just lost his whole navy and he's just gonna sit there and go oh. and he's gonna notice it. he he thinks that I'm weak um, which tells me he's probably been watching some of my playthroughs and he's like yeah let me go after this guy and he's gonna find out how you know this is why I do a delay okay who the hell is there um, we're gonna find out real quick who you are, dude, because you're about to get bombarded. <sighs> okay, so we've got somebody in the seas. Okay. I think this person is probably coming to try and see. I think somebody has been watching my playthroughs because he had no reason to attack me otherwise. Um, I was in talks with the United States, and if United States was a smart leader, and this may just be uh, incompetence uh, on a leader's part, you know, he didn't tell anybody, hey, look, uh, Spain and and uh, Ukraine are thinking about coming to join us. Oh, what, you going to come and bring me down and be like, ha, 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 he's weak? Well, guess what? Your dumb move, your incompetence is going to cost you your coalition. And this is what I'm going to tell you, because this this makes me mad. You, you want to make me mad, this is how you make me mad. Double cross me. Um, and then I will, and the thing is, I'll throw everything I have at you, and you better be prepared to have a knockdown drag out fight. Because that's exactly what you're going to get when you, uh, when you deal with me. Okay, so we got that going. Let's see. Um, let's move him. All this is, it's not even going to set me back because right now I could build infantry and build all that other stuff. So let me, let me start repairing my stuff. Let's see, um, airbase 2, arms, I need to get the arms industry. That, let's see, I got, I'm going to use my gold on that. I want my, see this is what happens when you win a game. And 94, and I'm not getting, oh, 13. All right, and so let's, let's build, well, now that we have that, let's build us that. All right. Let's see who else has been damaged. Oh, see, you, you missed the important cities. I mean, if you're going to attack me, attack me in the cities that are important, dude. Seriously, uh, all you, I mean, I don't even think I had anything in that city. Uh, I, um, I pulled everything either over here or, yeah. Da, 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 da. See, this is the advantage. You know, some people say keep all your stuff at home. Um, I disagree. I completely disagree. Uh, you shouldn't keep your stuff at home uh, because you you want to you want to keep some stuff at home, but only like okay. So look look here at Madrid. Here in Madrid, um, here in Madrid, I am in the center. It's going to be really hard to get to me. If I'm going to put anything, I'm going to put it there. Now I did put it up here because most people usually attack here, and not here. But um, apparently they attack there, so I got that. But um, I probably lost some hardware. But uh, let's see what I lost. Uh, let's see. I lost. Sorry. Uh, 
Uh, let's see. I'm getting hit, getting hit, getting hit, getting hit. Attack wing, engage, attack, Barcelona. So, I've been being hit for, golly. He's been hitting me for some time. He's been hitting me. So, day 26. So, he's been hitting me for about six hours. Okay, so he probably sent it in the middle of the night. Now he's going to wake up and find out that he's got no navy. And that I am on his shores. Because that's exactly where I'm going. Now, did I build an airbase here? Yes, I got an airbase coming in. So, I got an airbase coming in here. And then I need to take Bermuda. And instead, I'm coming after Cuba. So, Cuba, you're about to find out why you can't come into my territory. You know, I was talking to you guys about being, um, here, I want to, do I want to send, you know, I'm going to send this, and I'm going to send it out this gate because I know it's safe, and I'm going to send it over here, um, uh, waypoint, I'm going to send it after Bermuda, and... I am also going to send these two after Bermuda. Uh, I may lose the infantry. I'm not too worried about it. I may lose them. Um, actually, let's see if I can get it to attack. No. Because uh, there's just there's not enough to the junction. Okay. So I've got my I've got my units going there. I'm going to Bermuda, and like a dumbass, he never. He, he never got that taken care of. And so I'll, I'll be over there probably tomorrow. I, I'm going to play defense. He's going to think, oh, I'm look, he's licking his wounds. Do, he doesn't realize that, uh, you know, he walked right by my my naval patrol. So, um, let's see here. Uh, let's split. And... Let's just go attack. That way we get that. There, good. Okay, so I got the one. Where's my... Where's my... Okay, I don't see it. There's the one. Okay, so I had... I had that. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Okay, so I have my naval patrol. Sorry, guys, I got allergies. Um, I got naval patrol, and uh, I, this is how I got one ship. I'm gonna take out this ship, and so that's gonna do 40 damage. So I'm gonna take out at least one of the ships, maybe two. And let's see here. Let's see if USA says something. Not Libya. Um. Now, just my port cities with navy. Probably pre-landing party. Um, I'm taking out his navy with my navy patrol. Just keep an eye out. I'll give you right of way. If you guys can give us two spots, Ukraine... And I would like to join due to USA treachery. And I'm going to just give him a uh, send offer. Okay, there we go. So I sent him an offer for open borders. And this open borders will allow me... Okay, so I took out... Oh, damn. I took out a huge chunk. It's going to take a minute, but I'm going to take out his ships. It's not a problem. I'm not worried about it. Let's see what I can build in my cities, because... Okay, um, let's repair this. I need to be... Let's get this going first. This is important. Okay. And okay, let's see here. 
Alright guys, so this is part of my morning playthrough. I will check in with you guys later. There's a lot going on in the background, and um, I, will, I will let you guys, uh, I will talk to you guys uh, later today. I hope none of that got in my background. Okay. Okay, everybody, welcome back to part two. Let us see where we're at with um, with Spain. Okay. Cruiser? Uh, he's got cruisers? Oh, poor bastard. Let's see here. And hold on a second. I must have taken out several cruisers. You know what? This one's more important. I want this cruiser gone. Okay, yeah, you can't you can't have these cruisers in my backyard. You think just because you got cruisers, you're great? Guess what? I can build ballistic subs, and I can get nukes, and then I can nuke your butt. And that's what I can do. Let's see here. Um, switch to shared intelligence. Uh, don't have membership. Um, I'll try. Yeah, no, I can't. Um, let's see here. Let's see if I can. I, I generally won't do this, but he, we're talking about joining, so I'm going to join him anyways. Let's see. I can't. Yeah, he can show me all his. Um, but I can't I can't see I can't see him. I don't have a membership. If I had a membership, then I'd do that. See, I don't... I, I used to have a membership, but then I just... I, I just never really got into it. Hey, if you guys want to go down in one of my affiliate links, though. <laughs> uh, okay, perfect. Uh, Alright. Yeah. Uh, sorry. Um, yeah, but hey, if you go down to my affiliate links, you want to help me? Uh, buy a membership? Well, here, here, this is how you help me buy a membership. Yeah, if you go in through Amazon, it doesn't matter if you buy what, what it is that I recommend, but if you purchase something, uh, uh, when you when you click in that link, you can remove whatever it is that I am putting there to suggest it. Whatever you buy on Amazon uh, that day uh, that, from that link. So if you add things to your cart, and then maybe let's say you come back later that day, uh, you can and you purchase it or you come back within 30 days that you purchase it then I get a commission off of that and that's kind of that's how it helps the channel monetarily but you know it's everybody has their own preference of how they want to support the channel the way I want my channel to be supported is through likes comments subscribes uh, I prefer the comments and the interactions the the money is just you no know, it's just part of it I guess what happened to him? Why did he stop? Why did he stop? What the hey? Okay, I don't understand why he stopped. Oh, because I wanted to see what that was. Okay. Oh, and I apparently... Did I destroy that? Let's see. Okay, well, we don't know where it's at. But if, it, if unless it was going towards Libya, and I think these guys are trying to make a landing. Um, we'll see here. We will see here. And you know what? I need to focus my attention on this because cruisers. Here, let me show you the cruisers' weakness. Let's see where is navy. Navy is here. So a cruiser, its weakness is this. Well, actually, no, it's not really weak against. Well, it's 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 actually stronger against helicopters. Okay, uh, I stand corrected. Um, cruisers are can be deadly to helicopters, but helicopters can be deadly to cruisers. You know, if you got a five on five, well, then you know you're gonna you're not gonna do well. But if you are trying to complement your your, um, if you're trying to complement your uh, your other attacks, it will definitely help. 
So, this is going to be kind of funny to see if I actually make it. I, I hope I do. And um, I wonder if I'll come across the United States. So, let's see here. I want to get I want to get these taken care of. So, I got one going after him. After these cruisers are taken care of, because he took out my plane. Um... You know, after these cruisers are taken care of, I want to, uh, I, I want to, I want to really just, like, lay into this guy. Uh, I'm going to go up here and take care of that. So, let's go check in and see what's going on in, uh, in the Philippines. Okay, so, here in the Philippines, let's see, what do we got going on here? Okay, he's going, he's going that direction. I got this going. I've taken out all that. There's no navy here. I'm looking for his navy. Let's see if he even has any navy. Okay, no navy. That's a homeland. It's occupied. That's a homeland city. And that's his capital. Oh, dude, you, you better move it back here. So you've got one. So you've got no navy. Really? Is that all you are? I mean, that's pathetic, man. That really is pathetic. I, I feel sorry for you. Okay, so let's do this then. Well, hold on. Let's check and see if Argentina has a navy. Because I want to go after Argentina as well. Let's see. Occupied. Occupied. Oh, yeah. This is all Chile side. Okay, so that's a homeland city. Okay, so he's got the navy. Uh, that's an occupied. That's a homeland. Oh, he's got cruisers. Uh, let's see, that's occupied. Uh, and that's occupied. So, he, he's got, he can build a navy, it looks like. So, let's see here. <sighs> uh, alrighty then. Let's see. Hmm. I don't see anything worth really doing until I attack, and I won't be there until. And here, let me let me split this going on to land. And go there. Okay, this is gonna be fun. Okay, so he moved his anti air, and so one thing that I gotta be that I gotta be worried about now that I've seen that he has it is that um, Argentina has uh, has air. And so it's now time for me. I want to take this base here. I'm going to send split. I'm going to send two over to take this because I want this now. Um, again, I always talk about islands. Islands are your friend. Uh, make sure you, you take the islands because even if you lose all this, they're not... I don't really think about the islands until they start getting attacked and by then they're already taking damage and so you're gonna put them down to a grind that's really what the benefit is here so let's go let's go back to let's go back to Spain and see what Spain is doing all right so um, let's see here uh, do, 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 do. Uh, hold on I got the wrong one Spain interact there we go and I'm still learning how to do the switch I, I've got to set up the scenes but this is two 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 I want to see so we've got we've got about two minutes for that to hit and so let's see what else we can do and by the way I did build some stuff um, I've got four out of six cities going I'm just gonna kind of have to just deal with what I got but um you know the thing is, is he didn't take out. If he would have taken out this, this is where, this is where I I build my. <laughs> uh, basically, he took out everything, but where I actually build my my ships. If you want to take out my navy, which is generally the reason why you send your ships in, is to disable the navy part, and then you know deal with the rest. So, and we're gonna we're gonna inflict 47 damage on him, and we are a level two. Now I did do some research. I do have the 
the destroyer being upgraded and because I want to make sure that I am ready to fight a naval war and I've also got this being upgraded to a level 3 which will give me a 12 and a 6.5 I kind of hope people I really wish people would just send um, subs at me It'd be so much easier to sink you just send me your subs I mean I'll, I'll, I'll relieve them from uh, attack the 14 um, okay uh, two, 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 two. All right, so we've got we've got a minute here going. <sighs> All right, hey guys, it. I'd like to know what you guys think. Um, do you guys like this this battle? Uh, if the if you like the battle, great, fantastic, wonderful. Come join me. Um, six cruiser naval wing. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, so I got my I got my hit, but guess what? Yeah, uh, he's probably going to get me one more time. Um, because either that or I might get out just in time. Uh, we, we will see. But we have got a countdown going on here. That's what I love about four times speed. Yeah, four minutes. Yeah, I don't want to wait four minutes. I'll take it in a minute. We will see here. And here we go. All right, guys. Uh, we will wait for this attack. And it's just like the countdown, the suspense. It's like just sitting there waiting. It's like, come on, please hit. All right, so we want to see how much damage he does. We are probably going to take out one of his cruisers. All righty then. So next time we come back, he can't do as much damage. Now I feel like I've got him neutralized. And these guys will come in and kind of slow him down. So now that I've taken out that one ship, now I just, it, these guys will get less damage because every time they come in and hit. And so this is going to do a 1.5. So we're looking at about a 7.5 damage to that. So another 7.5 points. But by the time my naval patrol comes back, this cruiser will be sunk. Uh, and it's also doing less damage to my, to my population and to my buildings. And again, I need to start working on building bunkers. Okay, so we, we got this going. And he didn't even take... Oh, man. You know, if you're going to go after somebody, let, let me just offer you... Let me just offer you a piece of advice. You want to go after somebody, you want to go after their production, which is their components and their level 3 naval bases. I've got a level 3 naval base here and here. My main production, the things that I need in order to be able to build high-end weapons is components and electronics. Those should have been the first two cities. Why do you think I brought my naval patrol out here? Because, bam, they would have been sunk and and so on and so forth. I, I now need... I, I didn't put my troops in... Uh, or I didn't put my air units in a defense position like I should have last night. But um, it is what it is. Okay. So, let's see here. We... Oh... Okay, so um, I will tell him he, he's going. I don't know where he's going, but if he, I think he's going down. Um, let's see, how do I tell him? Okay, um, I will say that uh, uh, USA transport most likely won't make it but the trajectory looks like in your area you'll have to watch the replay uh, you know on one hand I get mad that people are using my my openness against me but on the other hand um uh, on the other hand, I, I also rely on it. So, I mean, it's a double-edged sword. Don't don't use it against me. But, you know, it, that's probably the reason why I would never... Uh, it's probably the reason why I don't watch a lot of players is because if I ever come across them, I, I don't want to... Uh, I don't want to... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? If I ever come across another player, I don't want to know what they have. I want to be able to have a fair game. 
And, you know, but the thing is, there's no such thing as a fair game. Because, you know, knowledge, experience, you know, there, there, it's never going to be a fair game. Because somebody's always going to have an advantage over the other. Whether it be the attack advantage, the art of surprise, the intelligence, and so on and so forth. So I've got 186. Let me see how my... Okay. Um, as you see, I put my intel in. Let's see here. Um, I need to put one in there. I'm going to put two in there. Um, that is, and I want to put two in there. And again, I want to put another one in my capital city. And so now, if you try and spy on me, good luck, mister. Really, good luck. And if you force me to, I have done it before. I will go after everything. But hey, I mean, Italy came together real nice, didn't it? Um, Italy came together real nice. So let me let me start getting these condensed and while I'm waiting for other things to happen. So uh, actually, let's move them down here because I want them ready to go. And I am not gonna I don't wanna I don't wanna wait around. Yeah, I just don't wanna wait around and I wanna be ready for an attack. Plus, I've got a lot of these cities over here i got to take care of. Uh, let's see. This is a two-star. So, let me do this. Move. All right. Um, yeah, let's go this route. And then, let's go here. And let's grab. Let's grab. Let's just grab that. Okay, I don't want to take a city that doesn't belong to me. But. Okay, Serbia. Hmm. Well, I see that Serbia got his... He was supposed to have... Who's attacking Serbia? Wait, I saw... I saw one of his cities that he had. Okay, there we go. He got his, he got his headquarters back. Okay, followed instructions. It's the only reason why I unkicked him. Because other than that, he just... And he needs to... He needs to start building his military, because I am under attack by uh, USA. I'm going to tell Ukraine, that way he knows. Um, USA trying to sneak attack. They think we're weak or something. Um, but, you know, why would you have a level 2 infantry? You better have something better. If all you're relying on is your, your navy, man, as you see, it's not really helping this guy out. I mean, I've already taken out quite a few of his ships. It's just a matter of time. For, are these cruisers? No, those are destroyers. And let's see here. You know, and this is the thing is, I'm going to end up making... Well, no, those I haven't really lost. Uh, 43, 82. He should be losing one of these ships. How long till he gets there? We got 40 seconds until we hit. At, uh, 13th attack wing, Zigzaga. Okay. And, okay, let's see here. He has... He's down to 43. So when... And then when he comes back, that will be another four, another point, four points. So by the time my my naval patrol makes its second round back, we'll be eliminating that second ship. And apparently we still haven't eliminated the other ship. Oh, kind of open. oh well, we've got we've got some time. So let me turn this attack wing. Let me get him going here, because there's no point in having him. Uh, there, there's no point in the. Uh, there, there's no point in having him continue to attack that. That's going to be gone. Uh, and once this hits, that's going to be gone. And so he, he just lost a whole fleet. And what did he do? He inconvenienced me. This is why you should not rely on on Navy. And I hope he's got a lot more coming. I, I'm planning on it. Um, but we don't, we don't know. Cuba may be thinking that he wants to see. He thinks I'm going to beg for mercy or I'm going to quit because I can't defend against Navy. He's attacking a couple of cities. He doesn't realize that, yes, I have, I have a Navy of my own. And I'm coming after you. So, you know, this is the thing is... Um, you know, you should really figure out who your foe is. And let's let's go take a quick look at Cuba because I just I feel like I, I feel like either 
there is a false sense of security or something's going on. How can Cuba? Let's see. Let's go to Cuba. Cuba is ranked 33. Okay, so he, he's no longer wet behind the ears, but he's really not that smart either. Okay. Um, Cuba, he's just, he, he's going to learn a lesson. Uh, and he's at war with Venezuela, huh? He can't even finish one war before starting another. So, well, I'm at war. Wow. So all we got left is Bol Oh, Bolivia. Okay, Bolivia took south. Um, okay, and then we got United States. Okay, these are experienced players, but they're really not that good. Mm. Either that, or I'm so prepared, and I've been attacked like this so many times. Because look at my rank. See? I've been, I, I, this isn't my first rodeo. I've been through this enough. Okay, well, you know what? Oh, wow, Serbia has. Good job, Serbia. Okay, I, I stand corrected. All right, um... All right, so that is... Let, let's go take a look at the other server real quick. Okay, and I need to... All right, perfect. I got the transition right. Okay, so what I need to do is... I need to send him over here. So here's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to skirt around without actually being caught. Uh, let's see here. Do I have... Okay, so let me do this. And let me patrol down. Let me go down here. And the reason why is because I just don't, I just don't want to have him see me coming. All right, guys. It looks like OBS is, um, it is giving me some issues and it's kind of causing some things to happen. But I want to kind of give you guys an update on Spain because that's really where the uh, where everything is at as you see they're still trying to land so and I am just swatting them off like flies as you can see here um, I've already hit let's see I hit him yeah he, he got a he got a nice hit and so I am I'm just curious if this he's probably trying to send this somewhere else which this will be fun um, I'm wondering if this is going to be turning. Okay, so we got that. And, I mean, look at his units. I mean, this far in the game, you shouldn't have units that low. You should at least have... Oh, nice. Really? No. Oh, darn. Oh, well. How much would I take off of him? Oh, okay. I eliminated that one. Okay, so attack... That. Okay, and so, hold on. I want you to attack that and then I want you to ah okay and then I want you to attack there we go you're not gonna last very long okay so we got him we got him we got him going back there okay perfect you know honestly I'm gonna just no, I'm moving them all right there anyways. So, this will be interesting. You're about to lose. Man, he, he just lost. He just lost several. Tr he's losing his troops left and right. This is just crazy. Um, I mean, I wish the guy would. <laughs> he should have thought it out. See, this is the importance of not only naval patrol, but of air units. So, yeah, I may not be able to build a ton of strikers. But I can still build these guys. They're cheaper. And I can still build uh, gunship helicopters. And those are cheaper too. And so it's it's not a big deal. I mean, you should definitely be looking at this. So I've got my, my guy here. And he's going to just sit there and wait when he gets there in about 49 minutes. And then that is going to be dead as well. Because I have two-star infantry, which means I get a 7.5 plus a 20... I think it's a 25% entrenchment bonus. So let's let's look at that. That's we're probably going to get close to eight or nine, and then on this uh, we're going to get 4.5. So let's see, nine and five, so that's about 13. Oh yeah, that uh, apparently uh, his units really didn't survive battle very 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 much. He's going to end up losing one of those off the bat. 
Um, I wonder... Okay, so this one, this one went, and there... He's still on the way. And... This one will be on the way in just a minute. I just want to I wanna attack or let him do that. So if you get a chance to stop it, you know that they're coming. Go to a junction. You get you get a, a, an entrenchment bonus on top of your, your defense. and But you only get it in the junctions. So that's something to be worried, to, to be thoughtful about. So that includes city junctions. But at any of the center junction points, you get an entrenchment bonus. Plus, apparently, whatever bonus you get with the other uh, entrenchment uh, devices, such as the, uh, where's the combat outpost, which will give you 33% uh, less damage. <coughs> okay, so it looks like we've got, oh, and that one was eliminated real quick, too. Oh, man, he's going to wake up and he's going to be like, oh my god, how did this happen? He, not only did he not take a city, but um, I'm, I'm sure as soon as this guy hits, the next time this guy hits, he's done. Um, he, he's down to like, I need to rebuild those and I need to upgrade them a little bit more, especially knowing that I got cruisers coming at me. But now once I get my stuff grouped up, what I'm going to end up doing is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to counter. You should never just sit and wait you should be countering because if you can repel their invasion chances are they sent at least half of what they had if not more uh, unless they came in overconfident like ha 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 I'm gonna just walk all over this guy he's weak well guess what I was weak in the beginning you could have taken me over then but uh, now now um, you, you won't be able to so um, with that being said, I will log off and I will see you guys tonight. This is going to be a pretty easy battle. I'll let you know how it all turns out. But I just I wanted to show you the importance of air units and how to uh, how to stave off an attack. So yes, I do have my ships, and that's all well and great and all. But also I have my air units. I have my naval patrol. I have units that I keep at home just in case just so that i can do this you don't want to keep a you don't need to keep a large force at home but you do need to keep a response force at home uh if you look at what i'm doing over in the philippines i keep a response force at home because i've been over like on the other side of the world and then had to defend myself and to, it takes a couple of days to get back there unless you already have a defense force there so make sure that you have a response force uh, whenever you attack somebody or whenever uh, you clear out your cities, you need to have some sort of response force in case somebody does try and land. Uh, that way you can stop them from coming. And uh, all right, guys, I will see you guys. Uh, I'll see you guys later.